fellow Toastmasters and guests. The Thin Red Line was a World War II novel which was later adapted into a movie and the music was, was composed by Hans Zimmer. If you have not watched that movie, I suggest you do. It represents the soldiers and the line between sanity and insanity. Why red? Red is the color that signifies dominance. How many of you have exercised dominance in your own lives? Tonight, in this meeting, I urge all of you to exercise dominance on the stage, whether it's table topics and our fellow speakers tonight delivering your speech. Just as the color red signifies as a traffic light to stop, but I suggest that we take red in a different color tonight that signifies dominance, courage, and perseverance. Tonight, in this meeting, we will have a few speakers, two of which will be doing their CC1 speech, our new members, lend them your support, and also a senior member who will be delivering a talk on successful club series on meeting roles and responsibilities. It is important to know our roles and responsibilities in a club meeting, lend her your support as well, and I hope tonight that you will be able to learn something from this speech. Before I pass the floor to our Toastmasters of the evening, he is a new member of the club, and he has been very courageous to take on the role of Toastmasters tonight. Let us see and watch his dominance tonight as Master of Ceremony. Let him your support. Now may I invite Toastmaster Arun, as the Toastmaster of the evening, to deliver his address. Good evening, the Toastmasters and guests. My name is Arun. I am your close master reading for today. The theme of today's meeting is a thin red line. It means breaking through your physical and mental barriers to achieve the impossible, to achieve your goals. That's what today's meeting is about. Now, a little bit history of close master international. It was founded by Ralph C. Smedley on 22nd October 1924 in the YMCA building at Santa Ana, California. I believe the C in Ralph C. Spedley's name for just now. The Toastmasters International values are respect, integrity, service, and excellence. Rice. Right now, there are more than 15,900 clubs worldwide and more than 350,000 members in 142 countries. In Malaysia, there are two districts. East Malaysia and Peninsula Malaysia. East Malaysia has 142 clubs and Peninsula Malaysia or District 102 has 394 clubs. Now, a little bit of history on Sunway Toastmasters Club. Sunway Toastmasters Club was founded in Club Sukan Sunway Sports Club of Sunway Group on 22nd August 1960, 1988 by Dr. Leo Fedricks. The sponsoring club is B. Utama. Toastmaster Club. Sunway Toastmaster Club has been a business distinguished club for the past 12 years since 2005. I now call upon all of you to refer to the page behind the agenda and read along. Every event, every event, every event has fun and a fun experience. Consistently high quality, unforgettable, noteworthy fellowship, united and network. Now you can see this small box on the agenda page here. This is a Toastmasters program. New members are given two manuals, competing communicator and competing leadership. In the competing communication manual, there are ten speeches. When the budding Toastmaster competes, these 10 speeches, he or she becomes a competing communicator. The Toastmaster then has an option to choose from a combination of 15 advanced manuals, ranging from storytelling to humorously speaking, each having 10 speeches. The leadership track involves completing role plays and assignments, such as carrying out the duties of a club district officer that will require more commitment and dedication to the Toastmasters program. Competing both advanced communication 
an advanced leadership tracks will grant you a title that is the highest award in Toastmasters, a title of Distinguished Toastmaster, or DTM for short. In addition, members receive monthly publications for Toastmaster magazine and newsletters. For today's agenda, uh, the meeting there were three parts. The table topics part, followed by a 25 minute break, and the project speeches after a break, and then the evaluation session, where each project speaker is evaluated and for continuous improvement. I now introduce my